Good morning guys, welcome back. Uh, this morning, what's today? Today is Wednesday, um, November something or other. 22nd, it's the 22nd. And right now it is currently 8.30 a.m. and I am just putting on a few little niblets of makeup uh, because I'm actually going to get my hair done and I'm doing quite, quite a drastic change today and you guys are always asking about like specific colors and whatnot that I use in my hair so whenever I get my hair done I like to bring you along. Tara is the queen so um, yeah this morning we're going to, I'm, I'm starting the vlog today because I did more of the same as last week. I just was sitting and filming videos the last couple days getting ready for my trip because tomorrow tomorrow morning i'm leaving for london and i'm super super excited i'm going to brighton first and then i'm spending two quick days in london and i'm just gonna go see some of the uk gals i'm really excited and then i fly to new york so i think what i'm gonna do is have this first vlog be the <laughs> let's use words alana this first vlog uh, will be the London vlog and then my second vlog will be the New York vlog because I'm actually super excited It worked out so perfectly. I just want to talk about New York really quick my friend Mary I'm I I'm assuming that she has been in a vlog at one point, but my friend Mary. She's so awesome She's such a She's such a successful lady. She's done so well with her job and she was on a three-month work term in New York and I had I had said multiple times that I would go visit her and uh, December 15th is coming up to the like the last day of her work term so I said well frig all right I will get on the plane I'll book my flight from London to New York and just stop in and say hello on the way back and then my friend Catherine was like oh my gosh like I want to come let's make it a girls weekend so I'm really excited New York is one of my favorite places in the world and this will be my fourth time going to New York this year which is so crazy to think that in a video last year I had said it was one of my bucket list places to go to so as many of you guys know already my stepdad is a pilot and this is my last year of flying standby so I'm going to be taking advantage of it as much as I can because as soon as I turn 25 I am cut off for life which is really depressing <laughs> I have been flying cheaply my entire life. It's gonna be such a culture shock to have to join the ranks of full full fare tickets. Anyway, so that's why I'm going. Really, really looking forward to it. And today we're getting the hair done. Hopefully have a fresh, fabulous new do for the trip. But before we do that, let's head to the salon and get this mop taken care of. <laughs> So we're here, just getting busy, getting busy on my head. We're going blonde, y'all. Going blonde, oh my god. We will, we will discuss color and treatment in a bit, probably once it's all set in, yeah. But until then, we have ordered not one, but two <laughs> DoorDash orders. <laughs> we have some Starbucks on the way and Tim Hortons. <laughs> Oh my god, and I'm very excited. Our Starbucks has been delivered! <laughs> and our second order has arrived. <laughs> you smell the food, don't you? It's looking so blonde. We just rinsed the color out. Yeah? Yes. All color information I will write in the description box below. They use L'Oreal Professional Hair Color. Yes? Yes. Yeah, we've and lived to do with the studio one. Yeah. So all the colors she used I will write in the description box. And now we're gonna, what are you doing? Purple Rain? We're gonna be pre-toning with the Purple Rain shampoo. Purple Rain. Access makes all of their own products and it's amazing. This one's extra special because we don't use a harsh surfactant like some of the other purple shampoos do. Instead, we just tripled up on the table. Sweet. Sold. So that's what we're going to be doing. Toning it and all that. And we're, we're chopping it up. It's going to be chopped up. I'm just going to dump it on your head. Purple rain. Make it. Oh, that looks cool. That's like a beaver tail. Right? <laughs> oh my god. 
purple nurple up in here, y'all. All right, what are we doing here? We are going to be using our Masquerade Organic Hair Treatment. And it's filled with lots of wonderful things. It's got metal foam seed oil, keratin, amaranth protein. Make your hair feel luxurious. <laughs> so this is the current state. It is unconditioned and so blonde. And this mask is gonna make it feel it's amazing. Like a spa treatment for your hair. <laughs> so this is the finished do. She did a chop. It's all blonde. I'm feeling so fresh. <laughs> the hair magician. I'm so thrilled. I feel so cheeky chic going to London tomorrow. <laughs> oh, is it pizza? Hello? Um, so I'm home. Hello world. Dema is here. Uh, hi. We've ordered the za. Oh, the this za. is what I'm doing right now because I don't have a bedroom light. <laughs> So, Dema's going <laughs> through some things. And I am packing now. Just uh, trying to pack. Dema's going through what the things. Is? It's face powder. Okay. I think Dejin is here. Dejin! 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 <laughs> The za has arrived. <laughs> I add extra matzo to everything. Extra Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. Yes. Dan and Dima just left. We we consumed all three of those virtuous pie pizzas, and it was absolutely amazing. Dan brought me. <laughs> A book. He was so cute. He's like, I know your flight to London's long and I know you wanted to read this book and he brought it for me. So Dan, thank you so much. That was so sweet. I look ridiculous. I had a glass of wine and I'm very purple, but um, now that they have exited the building, I must officially finish packing. I'm pretty close to being finito. I've got all my packing cubes set. I'm going to London and then New York. I'll be gone for a total of nine days if all goes well. Sometimes I get stuck on the plane, so I always like to, you know, be prepared. Then I've got all of my toiletries, hair care, all that good stuff. Sneakers, because I actually plan on working out this time, truly. Boots, hats, and then this little heels thing. I need to take an Instagram photo. I forgot to take a photo, so I need to bring that with me to take one. And uh, I think that's most of it. I need to pack my makeup now. Um, and once I do that, I'll pretty much be ready to rock, so. I'm just gonna finish packing up. And then I'm gonna watch Stranger Things and go to bed. And I will see you guys in the morning when I'm off to London. I'm so excited. So excited, can't wait. Can't wait to bring you guys along. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be a good time. Morning guys, happy Thursday. <laughs> Today is London day and I am, it's, it's setting in. Once I'm like packing and getting ready and leaving for the airport, it really hits me that I'm going, you know? Prior to that, it doesn't really seem real, but now I'm like, all right, yeah, we're going to London. I'm so excited. Uh, the, right now, it is currently 8 a.m. I woke up ridiculously early and had a bath and watched Stranger Things and, you know, did my hair and get ready, whatever. Whenever I go to the airport, whenever I go on a long haul flight, I like to do my hair and put like so much product in it that it will remain by the time I land, you know? I have a, it's about four and a half hours to Toronto, then I have a three hour layover in Toronto, and then it's the long haul to uh, London. So it's gonna be quite a long travel day. I will see you guys in London. Read my eyes, do I want to stay? If you thought you weren't made that way, it's the choices we make, we give and take, and I know you will keep trying. Said I think I know what you mean Pretty good Welcome for to dark. Brighton from a very dead face me. I think I slept approximately 
two hours on that entire flight and it was approximately 20 hours door to door so it's been a long travel day but I just got to my Airbnb in Brighton I know a lot of people have been asking me on Instagram and Twitter if I'm here with a brand but no I'm just I just came to England for shits and gigs this is on my own accord I'm paying for everything I bought this Airbnb but I have to show you guys it's so friggin cute oh I just walked in and I'm freaking out okay 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 so you walk in all right and on the left, here's the bedroom. I've already exploded my suitcase, sorry. Um, yeah, this is so adorable. The woman who owns this home, Tess, she has such amazing, like, bohemian style. Oh, I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed. So you walk in, and then this is the bathroom. Again, I've already exploded my things, but that's the bathroom amazing plant and then you walk in and look at this place look at this place it's so beautiful oh the lighting is amazing like this is a basement and it's so bright in here she's done amazing with the lights and then there's also a flippin little patio and it's such a beautiful sunny day and oh it's just so cute it's so cute i will link this airbnb in the description box for you guys <laughs> I am so excited. This is the cutest place I've ever seen. I'm freaking out. So I actually made the executive decision to stay awake. I was gonna land and then nap because I know that I, I knew I wasn't gonna sleep, but uh, I think I actually just wanna, I only have two days in Brighton and I just, I just wanna see it all. And I think like just getting here just got me so excited and this Airbnb is like just everything I could have hoped for and I'm so stoked. So I think I'm actually just gonna slap some makeup on. I'm gonna go see Anna and I'm so excited. And we'll go from there, but I'm gonna brush my teeth, clean my armpits, and put some makeup on my face. Thank goodness for makeup and hats. That's all I've gotta say. <laughs> Glossier Jam, H&M hat, Aritzia turtleneck. Anna, where are you? I'm ready. <laughs> Bless your heart. <laughs> we just, we ate tacos, past tense. And uh... Have you vlogged much today? No. Is this like the first time you're checking I'm, Yeah, I'm horrible. She's I'm... live, but barely. Barely. SOS. <laughs> <laughs> My eyes are closing as we speak. But Susie's wonderful and she's so small. She's so little. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to show. <laughs> <laughs> she's such a tiny little <laughs> I do look really I'd, be such a good, I'd be such a good boyfriend for you. Oh my god. Morning. <laughs> You're legitimately dead. <laughs> Jet lag, jet lag is getting me good this time around. I realized I didn't vlog much, but it's just because we were having such good chats. <laughs> I kind of kept forgetting to bring up my vlog camera. I'm gonna have to go vlog the ocean today just to get some B-roll going because it was just so fun. We had such a nice stroll and then I went and met up with Susie for dinner who is the cutest little bean. She's five foot one. And it's so funny when you've been watching these people on YouTube for years, you kind of just don't, I don't think of their size. So when I saw her, I was like, you are just the sweetest little button. Oh, and the poor thing, because by the time I met up with Susie, I was completely delusional. I was going on like 30 hours of being awake because I didn't really sleep on the plane at all. Maybe like an hour, <sighs> just a little dozing off here and there. But poor thing, I was like blacking out by the time we hit dinner, but we went to a place called Oaxaca. It was a Mexican restaurant. Just had an awesome chat, and I'm actually gonna go meet up with Susie today. I just tried FaceTiming her. Did she say anything? <laughs> okay, I'm up, she says. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> 
Um, so I'm gonna have this tea, put some freaking eye patches on to try and help my my sleep. Got the tea, pretending to be an honorary Brit. All set, ready to rock, kids. Freezing as well, might I add. This is I'm, quite mild. It's like it's this got such a, ch a chill <laughs> though. It's got such a bite. I actually don't know how you're just in a leather jacket, but anywho, <laughs> you know me. Not a girl. Susie's come to get the coat. It's a pretty great coat. I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I just have to have everything you have. <laughs> <laughs> Same. I'm regretting getting rid of my purse. Hmm. Do you know what though? If you I watched your video, if watch yeah, channel, yeah. If no one knows. You can't tell. You. Looks great. Looks great. And that coat, fab. Twelve out of ten. So good. <laughs> morning, guys. We meet again in the living room of my Airbnb. Uh, it is Sunday morning. It is currently 9.40 a.m. and I have been awake since five. The best day was Susie and Josh. Yesterday, it was so much fun. We totally just had such a lovely wander. We went through, I, was it the last time I vlogged? No, yeah, oh my gosh. We did the tour of the uh, royal palace, the pavilion. It was super cute. And then we had an afternoon tea and a scone after with creme and jam, and it was delicious. And then I got back to the Airbnb around five and I was supposed to go meet Anna and Mark for dinner because they were going to a concert later. So I was just gonna go join them for burgers and I completely passed out. <laughs> I died. Sorry, Anna. I'm really sorry for dying. Anyway, this morning, um, Anna's actually coming to get me at 10 a.m. and we're gonna go to her house and film two videos. And I'm really excited because we were kind of scared that we weren't gonna be able to fit in filming. Um, so I'm really happy that we're making it work and we're gonna film two videos I'm excited for you guys to see and then I'm gonna be checking out of this Well, I'm actually checking out of this Airbnb now and then I'm gonna be heading to London for the next two days And that's gonna be a lone wander. We're gonna see what we uh, get up to I just basically want to go wander some Christmas markets and eat some really delicious food, but uh, I'm sad to be leaving this Airbnb. It's so adorable and sad to be leaving Brighton I just like Susie and Anna. I just love them so much. They're just such awesome women 
women and it's just been such a fun trip to Brighton and it, it's just so nice meeting people uh, who you've watched on YouTube for years and just having them be so exceptional in real life you know it was just so fun and um, yeah I had such an awesome time and it's been a lovely couple of days in Brighton and I'm sad to leave but goodbye beautiful Airbnb I shall miss you. This is my angle at all times, and I'll go back and watch the footage, and I'm like, can you just make yourself yeah, not look giant? Women, the chin women on Instagram. Yes! Oh my I god. Thing. That was so funny. Um, so I'm at Anna's house. I'm witnessing this in real life, and I'm <laughs> so thrilled. Oh, it just, yeah, like, you know, you know this <laughs> scene. And we're about to film, we're about to film two videos. Look at the setup. So professional, you have the screen and everything. Oh, yeah. Oh, damn, girl. Um, Yeah, I am completely fangirling over their home. It's so beautiful. And, uh, yeah, she made me breakfast. Mark made you coffee. Mark made me coffee. Mark, Mark made me coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I love when you say Mark like that. Well, because she said, oh, like, Mark. you're going to meet Mark. And I said, do I call him Mark or do I call him Mark? <laughs> like, what an odd, it's just funny. I prefer your way of saying it. Huh? No, we're just talking about you. Oh. Don't worry. <laughs> do you prefer to be Mark or Mark? Mark. <laughs> Mark. That sounds American, like, Mark. Oh, how's, what's Mark. the difference? Mark. 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 <laughs> we just finished filming our two videos. We're really excited. It was really fun. It was She's so touching fun. up her lips. It was so fun. It was so quick. And we were just yeah. like, Yeah. Oh, we finished in an hour. Yeah. Two videos. That never happens. Never happens. Full face, thumbnails, everything. We've already imported the footage onto our laptops. We're, we're so, so productive. And it's a fun day. Damn. This is supposed to be a day of Damn, best. girl. We are so not just, resting. Just, <laughs> just like brushing the effort. <laughs> so now um, we're just doing a little photo op now so that we can have some Instagram pics and then I'm gonna leave and I'm so upset but it's been such a blast don't oh. leave me <laughs> what like people would like this <laughs> receding hairline <laughs> when it's like quite the opposite we're furry humans <laughs> anyway excited for you guys to see them I'm gonna shut this off now and go play okay bye <laughs> Morning, guys. I am in the Airbnb in Shoreditch in London. I realize that I'm the worst vlogger and didn't film actually getting here yesterday, but I was so tired. I was so tired. I got in at about 3.30. Is there another light? Nope, that's it. All right, cool. I got in at about 3.30 yesterday. Actually, maybe I'll do my makeup in here. That's a better idea. Oh, please. Well, that's better. Don't I look delightful in this light? Uh, yeah, so yesterday I left Brighton and I got to London, got to my Airbnb. I'm staying just outside of Shoreditch. It's like right on the cusp of Hackney, I do believe. Last night I actually went up, I went and met with a friend and we went to a Christmas market and then we tried to go to Dishoom. Oh, we went to the Christmas market that's in Covent Garden or just beside it. And then we tried to go to Dishoom actually and there was like an insane lineup outside, or sorry, a queue. There was a very large queue outside, um, like two lines. They had two lines separating it, and I just thought, oh, what the heck. So we ended up going to Bill's beside it, and I had really good curry anyway, so that's fine. This morning, I'm going to walk to a place called Cream. It looks like a super cute uh, brunch place in Hoxton, I believe. And then I'm actually going for lunch with Rima who's actually the, oh, I don't know if that's her position anymore, but I actually met her at Coachella. She was the uh, she was the UK Kiehl's PR lady, and she was absolutely awesome, and so I'm gonna go for lunch with her today. I don't know, I yeah, after that, I'll just continue my wander. Let's go get some breakfast. Uh 
So, hello, today is Tuesday. I bought Night Hall last night and I completely died and it actually worked and it's after 10. It's actually almost 10.30 right now. Another fail of a vlogging endeavor yesterday, but I went and saw the Book of Mormon last night and it was freaking amazing and I realized that I left my vlog camera in my shopping bag yesterday and I mean, there's no, there's no cameras allowed anyway, but just know that the Book of Mormon was incredible. Uh, so freaking funny and being a human who grew up Mormon <laughs> made it all the more funny. I know that some people would be offended by it, but as an ex-Mormon, I found it freaking hysterical and it was amazing. Uh, I thought I would show you guys what I bought yesterday. It's super awkward to vlog when I'm by myself, especially when I'm like buying something, but I went to Liberty yesterday, got this beautiful big purple bag, and I bought this uh, mustard coat from a brand called Sesson. And everything at Liberty yesterday was 20% off, so this ended up being like 160 pounds or something, which was really amazing, especially since our Canadian dollar isn't too awful uh, next to the pound right now. So I got a big yellow wool coat for 20% off, so that's what I bought yesterday. I'm looking extremely delightful this morning. Um, my flight was delayed. I'm flying to New York today. My flight was delayed by a couple of hours, so I'm actually going to meet with Lily Pebbles, Miss Lily Pebbles, for lunch. Um, and I'm just gonna be, well, I just need to pack up my suitcase and then we'll be off for lunch. So it'll be the last day in London today. It's beautiful, it's sunny. I'm gonna go eat some good food and then I'll be off to New York, so this vlog will be ending soon. Not until I shove my camera into Lily's face first. <laughs> kidding, but not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> lamb, this lamb. Oh my word! We've got a beautiful spread here. So it's like <laughs> so good. <laughs> We've come to the Christmas shop at Liberty, and Lily's looking for some ornaments. <laughs> Trying to find a koala. Do you have a koala? <laughs> Decor for the, the your, is it? It's not your first tree. Is it an old tree? No, but it's like our first tree in our proper house. I'm gonna get one for me and one for Rich, and then every year we're gonna get the ornament. It's really cute. This is. I'm just gonna mail you an ornament for every occasion now. <laughs> oh, you got a book? Here's an ornament. Thanks. <laughs> I think there's ones at the front that are my favorite. Fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> you've gone for all the cactus. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want one that looks like a house, that would be cute. Like That would be, yeah!